Addies, Grunts, Admin, Sweet Banana Gaming here with more of my Pokemon Y Wonderlock. In the last episode, we actually made our way over to Kumarine City, but today we're gonna actually not go into Kumarine City just yet. We're not really explore. We're gonna go up this way, route, well, we're on Route 12. We're gonna go into, I believe it's called Azure Bay. We can get another encounter here, of course, and do some other fun stuff. Do a little bit of training. Um, I don't really want to get everybody overleveled here because, you know, I'm getting pretty close to the level limit, but, you know, I just want to explore a little bit. There's some items to be found. I think I have enough repels. Uh, ooh, we've got a Magikarp. I wasn't sure that Timothy would be able to take on this fisherman here, but if all he's got are Magikarp, then we actually should be fine. But anyway, we're just going to explore a little bit of the Azure Bay. It's quite easy to get lost around there. At least for me, I don't know. It's easy to lose your bearings because the camera angle isn't fantastic. Um, but we're just going to explore around a little bit. Probably not try to fight all the trainers because, as I've said, we're kind of overleveled as it is. But just to, well, I mean really Timothy could use a little bit more training, although again, if we're going to have mostly water trainers, it won't be too much of too much use to train him here. But we'll do it. Get him up a couple levels. Get him at least up to level 30, probably. Of course, we've got all these Magikarp to fight. Before we can do anything, must fight all those Magikarp. Ah, uh, no, I don't need to switch. want to keep Timothy getting all that experience. Uh, let's go ahead and dig. It's gonna take two turns, I guess, no matter what I use. Uh, I, could, I guess I could use close combat for the rest of them, but I kind of want to want to save my close combats, just in case of emergency. And another Magikarp. Yeah, he has- what- he's the guy with six Magikarps? Yeah. Magikarp, I guess. Yeah, that's a lot. For not a whole lot of experience, actually. We'll see if we can even get to level 29 off of these things. I don't know. I don't think we'll make it. We might not make it. Yeah, I think we're just barely gonna not do enough. Not get enough experience, that is. To make it to level 29. We'll get really close. Okay, just got one more of these things. And I'll go ahead and close combat. I most likely won't be using it very much. Just want to get this over in one turn. And, oh, we do! Okay, we do make it to level 29. Just barely, but we did it. Good. Alright. So now we're gonna surf. I'm actually gonna put up a repel. There's some- there's a, an encounter we can get when we get into Azure Bay. But for the meantime, I'm just going to put up some repel so we can explore around. Then I'll do my encounter. And then I think that'll be it. I mean, Timothy could still use a couple levels before he's um, up, to, up to speed with really the rest of our party and also with the gym leader's Pokemon. But this gym coming up is pretty easy, if I remember correctly. And I think Timothy will do just fine. It's a grass-type gym. I think Timothy could probably solo the, solo the gym now if he had to. And we've also got the gym trainers to train up against. So honestly, I'm going to kind of try to leave... Oh, I wasn't fast enough. I had a chance to avoid that swimmer. What I was going to say was I'm going to try to avoid as many trainers as possible around here. Because I don't want to overlevel people. And I really don't need... Well, I don't need that much experience anyway. Um, we'll go ahead and put Ace. Ace, I think, is only one level from the level limit. The level limit, I believe, is 34, which, correct me if I'm wrong, because I lose track of this. I'm, I'm doing two challenge runs at the same time. Over on my main channel, I'm doing a Pokemon White 2 unlock, and I have to remember my level limit for that. And then I also have to remember my level limit for this. I'm pretty sure the level limit is 34, which you can see right now. And so, you know, you might be yelling at the screen right now, saying, it's this, it's this. But, yeah, I can't see it right this second, but I'm pretty sure. 
Okay, uh, let's see. I sent out Sabat against this guy, but really all Sabat has is Thunder Punch. Which, against Skrelp in particular, I don't know if I want to do direct contact, but we'll be alright, I guess. Yeah, I thought that was a possibility. But we have antidotes. I'm, pr I'm pretty sure we have plenty of antidotes, so we'll be alright. And you're gonna go to level 33, which it's fine if you get to the level limit. We don't really need you for the gym. Sabat. And Whalmer. Um, might as well keep you in. Okay. That wasn't too bad. Alright, let's go ahead and just heal that poison real quick. I mean, it doesn't do out-of-battle damage anymore, thankfully, but... I still want to have everybody all healthy, in case we get into a tight spot. Alright, so let's see. I'm going to really try now. Can I...? Okay. I made it past her. Good. Okay, so right here... This is the only time we get a really good view of what we've got over here. There's a thing over to the left where there's patches of grass and stuff. I might try to catch my encounter over there. Not that it really matters. Um, and right here we have this guy. This guy gives us the Ampharosite, which we could totally use on Sabat. But again, I don't know whether or not I'm going to use Mega Evolutions. Um, I think at the very least I'm going to wait until we get to the Elite Four. Or maybe when we do the final battle against Team Flare. You know, as a matter of fact, I was talking about get getting lost here, but since I'm trying to avoid as many trainers as possible... Hi there. Oh. Darn it. I thought we somehow managed to slip by her, but she caught us. But anyway, we're gonna try to avoid as many trainers as possible, so to be honest, I don't think we have to explore most of this... the water area right now. I could be wrong, but I don't think there's that many items. I don't know that there's any items over in that side. I know there's items on the little, like, the grassy patch. Which we're gonna go to right now. But I don't think there's anything else. So, as long as we're not really too worried about fighting trainers anyway, we might as well just go there and then we'll pretty much be done. Let's be... I'm gonna make this episode a little bit on the short side. But... I mean, I don't wanna- I wanna save the gym for sort of its own episode. Now, we do have a rival battle before we go to the gym. So really, if we get this done quickly, we could have plenty of time to have our rival battle now. Yeah, we might do that. I think we'll do that. Alright. But in the meantime... Okay. Defeated that girl. So we're just gonna... Yeah, we're just gonna stay this way. Um, where is the entrance? Did I pass by? Because is it here? Again, the camera angle messes me up. I think it... Yeah, here it is. Alright, so... We can also get an encounter. Which I will do momentarily. First, we're gonna get the TM for x -Scissor, Which, that's actually pretty good. That's a good move. And it could be good for type trumping in certain situations, but let's see who can learn it. Nobody on my team currently. Well, it's alright. It's a good move to have eventually. And a deep sea scale. I think we can also find the deep sea tooth here. In case we ever get a clam pearl that we want to evolve. Yeah, as far as Pokemon that evolve by trade, I'm going to leave that up to you guys, whether or not you want to allow me to do that. Like, I could trade with myself in another game. Um, but I don't know. I probably won't be in that situation for... for the most part. Alright, I'm not gonna put Repel up in this case. I'm going to get my encounter here. Hopefully get it, that is. Let's see, I have a timer ball. Did I get any quick balls? I don't think I've been able to buy any yet. So who do I want to put up front? I believe uh, Sabat still has Thunder Wave. Yeah, you still have Thunder Wave. So I'm gonna put you up front. We're gonna catch ourselves something. I didn't mean to exit out all the way. And... Sorry, I like to keep my team in proper order. Although, since I have such a rotating team all the time, I, there really is no proper order. But I like to have Ace. 
as a default up front, so I switch everybody with him. I don't know. And we got a Slowpoke. Alright. Just gotta catch it now. Let's see. I don't think a Tackle will do enough to knock it out, actually. Slowpoke has pretty decent defense, I think. I think one Tackle will be fine. I'm trying to- I'm trying to hope- well, Sabat's attack- yeah, Sabat's physical attack actually is not good. It's not very good, so... We can do another one of those, even if it crits, we'll be good. But this should be plenty to catch the Slowpoke, he's being nice and paralyzed for us. We should be able to get him. Might as well just use a Great Ball, just to be sure. All right. So we got the slowpoke here. And blah, blah, blah. You know what to do. We're gonna nickname it. Just like we always do. All right. And I'm going to send out a tweet before I start to go online, let you guys know I am starting a wonder trade. All you guys out there in in real time right now. I'll give you some time while I'm connecting to the internet. In case you want to get your DS ready and shoot me out something real quick. I don't know, that's, that's sort of my, like, what I would hope to happen. Like, it's sort of my goal for this entire challenge, not just to successfully complete this challenge, but to eventually get someone to successfully wonder trade with me who's watching. You know, it's a long shot, but especially because not doing it live, it's a lot harder to coordinate. But I, you know, worth a try. It'd be really cool if I ever actually did succeed at it. Let's see, how many people are online right now? Obviously not a lot of people wonder trading. Although, given the entire population of the world, there would never be that many people wonder trading at once, probably. Probably less and less so as the as these games get older past their release date. Ooh, from Istanbul in Turkey. You know, Istanbul was Constantinople, but now it's Istanbul, not Constantinople. All right. What do we have? It's a Wurmple. I believe I already have a Wurmple I got in Wonder Trade. So unfortunately, I will have to trade this, and its name is Bug. It has a nickname and everything. It's sad. I can't keep it. I'm pretty sure. I'm gonna check. But yeah. I can't keep this Turkish Wurmple. I'm pretty sure. Let's double check, though. Um, yeah, here's my other Wurmple. This one had a nickname, though. It's sad. Oh well, we gotta trade it. Sorry, Bug. Sorry, Bug from Istanbul. Let's find another trade partner. And Anthony from Michigan. Alright, we're a little closer to home this time. But let's see if let's see if we get a Pokemon that we haven't caught yet, or haven't received, I guess, to be more accurate. It's a Zigzagoon. Well, we already have Lucifer, so we have to get rid of this one too, unfortunately. We might be here a while, so any of you guys who were on Twitter, you have another chance still to Wondershade with me. But, uh, yeah. Hopefully this isn't too many more tries. I guess it gets harder the more Pokemon you obtain in Wonder Trade. With Dupes Claws and everything. There's... Well, the more common Pokemon are traded more often. So you're more likely to get one of those, the Wurmples or the Zigzagoons. Especially now with the Mega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, there's so many Wurmple and Zigzagoon out there. But let's see what will we have May from New Hampshire. Volcanion, please. Well, 
I am not a hacker. I am not able to obtain a Volcanion. Not yet. You'll have to wait for the event like everybody else. Ooh, an Octillery. Now the trick with this is, I forget at what level Remoraid evolves into Octillery, so I need to check that this isn't over the level limit. But, uh, Octillery gives me a good opportunity to do a little bit of side promotion for my main channel, Sweet Banana Gaming. If you go there, you can check out this series I do called Sweet Speculations. I currently only have two episodes up there, but one of my episode, my first episode, in fact, was my 100 subscriber special, and I did a little collab with another YouTuber, Starkiller, on why Remory evolves into Octillery. And you know what? This Pokemon is one level above my- Now I really need to know, because he's right on the threshold of my level limit. I'm pretty sure that he's one level above. I'm gonna need to check this real quick, though. I don't know, guys. I'm I'm almost... I'm probably gonna beat the gym pretty easily. Should I make an exception? I, I don't know. I can't, I can't break rules like that. That wouldn't be fair. So let me just confirm. Level 34 is, in fact, my level limit. Unfortunately, this lovely Octillery... It would be great to use- well, you got a special attack lowering nature. Anyway, I'm sorry, Octillery. I, I wanted to keep you because you're perfect. Like, I did an episode on you. I got to like you. I've really never used an Octillery either, but I would have been excited to be able to use one now. But you are one level over the level limit, and that counts. Gotta follow the rules, unfortunately. I mean, it's not like I would use it. Ooh, we got someone from Tejas. It's not like I would use it for this gym anyway. It's got a type disadvantage. But this is for the best. Maybe later on we'll get another Octillery that's at the proper level. Or within the level limit, I don't know. Ooh, a Pichu. All right, we can probably keep this because I doubt this Pichu is past level 34. I'm not sure what level Remade evolves into Octillery now. I thought it might have been 20 something, but hey, maybe it just evolved and it was level 35. I don't know. Well, we gotta check out this Pichu, because we can keep this, and it might be a worthwhile investment if we, you know, if something. We already lost Bob, our first electric type. If something terrible happens to Sabat, I mean, we have a mine in, but it might be better to potentially have a Raichu. Hmm. Oh, Panda! That's a cute name! That's a cute name for a Pichu. Even though it doesn't really make sense, but it's still a cute name. Alright, well we have Panda the Pichu. I know it's the trainer name, but for those of you who are coming in a little late, that's what I'm using as sort of my theme for naming Pokémon. If they don't come with their own nickname, I'm just gonna call them by what their trainer name is. What their original trainer name. Because, you know, a lot of Wonder Trade Pokemon don't come with nicknames, so gotta make your own up. And I think it's easier just to go with whatever the trainer name is. Okay, so we can't go this way. I think there was another way to get out, but... We're not gonna explore around anymore. There might be some items left, but maybe I'll do that after the gym. When I don't have the- when I'm not right up against the level limit, so I don't have to worry about training. But for now, we're just gonna go this way. We're gonna go back to the- ooh, I, I forgot, I have to avoid- I did avoid her, okay, but I already fought him. I just realized I could have gotten stuck by her. I really did not pay attention at all when I was just f sailing by. But anyway, we have to go and find the Pokemon Center, which is actually- the kind of annoying thing about this town is it's on the other end of town. And let's see, there's berries there. There's not a whole lot to see on this end of town either. There was that- you know, oh, I was gonna say we could talk to that one girl that we get a different TM from every day, but first we have to talk to Professor Sycamore and Diantha. Diantha? You already know, I don't know how to pronounce her name, so whatever. Why, hello, sweet. Congratulations. I see you finally obtained everything you need for Mega Evolution. A Mega Ring for the Pokemon. I mean, a Mega Stone for the Turner, a Mega Ring for the Pokemon. Or, a Mega Ring! For the trainer and a mega stone for the Pokemon, something like that. And a strong bond with your Pokemon. A strong bond? 
I don't remember how I did Diantha's voice. It was kind of plain, I think. It's only a hypothesis, but I think a bond between Pokemon and Selena is the key to this new evolution. I don't think so, because I'm pretty sure you can Mega Evolve a Pokemon you just got. But, you know, it's, it was nice for them to put that little in there. I don't know if it's actually part of the mechanics. I don't think friendship... Ooh, we got Fly. I don't think friendship plays a role in this, in Mega Evolution at all. It would be interesting if it did. It would make things, you know, a little... You have to think a little bit more. Anyway... Um, Diantha's talking about being an actress. Oh, never mind me. I'm just babbling about my own things. Yes, you are. Let's have a battle the next time we meet. Well, I really hope the next time we meet, like, I hope we don't meet again until I'm at the Pokemon League, because I'm not ready to take you on. You would destroy my whole run. All right, real quick, let's just take this quiz with from this totally random TM quiz. Um, the user's not holding an item. Acrobatics. And we get that TM. Which actually, that could be pretty good, a pretty good TM to have, so it was worthwhile. Now, this hotel, have we found Mr. Bonding? I really don't care. Like, I'm not going to use O powers anyway, so it doesn't really bother me if we don't get everything. Alright, we have to talk to her, get on the monorail, go to the other side of town, which is just weird. But hey, we gotta do it. Anytime now. There we go. Alright, and we do have a rival battle. I'll, I'll do that rival battle before we call off this episode. So let's go and heal up first, of course. So this episode ended up being a pretty full length anyway, just from all of the times we had to wonder trade over again. That's alright. Okay. Let's see what we've got over here. Quick balls at last. Okay, I'm gonna get ten of these. And that's about it. That'll help me out a lot. Like, I don't have to worry about... I won't have to worry as much about trying to weaken a Pokemon I'm trying to catch. Alright, so we gotta do this trainer battle. And, oh, where is Caleb? He's late. I guess I could call him Bob again, since Bob the Rotom is dead, unfortunately. Alright, so I'm gonna lead with... No. I'm gonna lead with Timothy. He always leads with Meowstic, and I think Timothy will be fine against it. So get him a little bit of extra experience. And let's do it. There you are. Just in time. Sorry to keep you waiting. The reason I wanted to meet you is I want to see Mega Evolution in action. Um, whether, whether or not I use it up to me? Well, yeah, I'm not really gonna use it in this battle, Calum. I'm sorry. Again, maybe toward the end of the game, Maybe in the final battle against Lysander will be the first time, because I know he uses a Mega Evolution the last time you fight him. So maybe I will for that. Um, and then probably, possibly for the Elite Four, because, well, or at least the Champion, because the Champion uses Mega Evolution. Really, the Elite Four don't. It's kind of disappointing. I like an Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, at least in the rematches. Nah, yeah, that's not going to do anything. At least in the rematches, the Elite Four members use Mega Evolution. Alright, so we're going to whittle this Meowstic away. We got the burn, which is nice. A disarming voice. Not going to do anything to me. And this burn won't be quite enough to take it out. So let's just dig. I wonder if it's going to faint while we're still underground. Yes, it will. So I forget now. Will it have us... I think it'll have us use Dig. Ooh, and Timothy's at level 30. So I think it's going to have us use Dig and reset. Nope. But I can switch. Which is good, because he's got a Frogadier, and I do not want to keep Timothy out against that. No need for that. Alright, Sabat. You got this one. Of course, I had to be careful. This thing could hit decently. Oh, that was a crit. I was gonna say that was a decent hit, but it was also a crit, so... And we one hit KO'd it. So it's all good. And Absol. Well... Now yeah, let's use uh, Nahum. I was gonna say we could use Ace. Ace is already at the level limit, though. And let someone else have some fun. I think Nahum is well equipped to take it out. 
And we're matched in level, just like we were with... We had uh, that Frogadier and Sabat were matched in level. And we one-shot it. Hooray! All right, Nahum is level 32. Nahum has come in handy. I never thought I would want to use a sock, to be honest. But at least up to this point in the game, in the fairly earlier stages in the game, his stats are pretty good because, you know, he's a Pokemon that doesn't evolve. So for the beginning of the game, his stats are pretty good. So he's been nice. I don't know if he'll outlive his usefulness, but we'll see. We got a Sky Plate, and I forget if this guy... Does this guy give, give you anything? No. He talks about Rain Dance and Drizzle, but he doesn't give you a TM. Alright, so we're just gonna heal up, and then we'll take on the gym in the next episode. We're basically just be... Should be pretty easy. I think Timothy will just burn everything. That's what he does best. So, that'll, uh, that'll do it, I guess. So, guys, if you like this video, please leave a like, and if you'd like to become a grunt, please subscribe to Team Eclipse. We have new content pretty much every day from all of our different admins. And also, if you'd like to check out my channel, Sweet Banana Gaming, there's a link in the description, and there's also an annotation at the beginning and at the end of the video. You can check out my stuff. I do Let's Plays kind of like this. I have a Pokemon White 2 Unlock that I'm, I'm doing right now, as I mentioned. And I've got other gaming content as well. Also got two episodes of Sweet Speculations, which I also mentioned. Check those out if you want. You know, always glad to have more people, more viewers. Anyway, though, guys, that's going to do it for this episode. I will see you guys on the next episode of my Pokemon Y Wonderlock.